Hi friends, this is Annette of AnnetteLeonard.com joining you again with another moment for chronic wellness. And if you are watching me on video, you can see that this weekend I had a shower. I know for those of you who don't have chronic illness, that may not seem like a big deal, but in my world, it's a very big deal. So new lease on life with a shower. Um, so I want to keep talking to you about shelter in place, because for those of us who experience chronic illness as disability and who may not be out in the world of work uh, because of it, we are your experts. This experience of pandemic and social isolation and shelter in place is our event. We have been training for this, y'all, and we have some things to teach you about how to do it well. And so my tip for today is exercise. And it's a funny thing, <laughs> me telling you about exercise, <laughs> um, because it's really not my forte. It's not. And yet, um, it is imperative, whoever we are, that we move our bodies at whatever level we can. Now, for those of you healthy types who may be watching this, get outside, do yard work, um, take your kids on a walk, go ride your bike, get in the sun, go somewhere and throw a frisbee, be active. And for those of you who are closer to my level of sedentary, get on YouTube and check out fibro yoga or yoga nidra and do something that is more of a slug speed. <laughs> and um, so this is a choose your own adventure. There is all levels of activity here, but to the extent that you are able, move your body. I mean, um, now is the time for those of you who have been wondering how you might be incorporating fitness in your life to start building some habits around fitness in your life. And there is everything from the free off the internet and on lots of different channels to um, some amount of paid like apps like Daily Burn to just getting outside and moving your body. But um, in addition to helping with stress and sleep and some amount of pain and anxiety um, and doing all kinds of things like reducing um, hypertension and heart disease and plaque in our veins, um, the utility of increasing your physical fitness is endless. And for those of us who physical fitness can push us into situations like flares or um, crash, uh, we have to be careful. And it is still important to be using our body as much as we can. So shelter in place and move our bodies. All right, folks. It's just one more way that we can tend to our own wellness. Glad you're here. Look forward to seeing you again. I am always, always, always hoping to hear from you. So please leave me a comment, a question, a thought, what you'd like to hear me talk about and or what you are doing to increase your fitness during this time of shelter in place. Until we're together again, thank you for being here and be well. <laughs>